Where are they? Sonny's upstairs. Jason's out. He's been looking for the kids. He should be back any minute. Mm -hmm. There he is. Jason. Okay, I got a cryptic message on the phone telling me to get down here right away. I'm down here. What is going on with the boys? Michael called. Is he all right? He was, he was about to tell Sonny where he was, and, and Faith took the phone away. The last thing Sonny heard was a gunshot. You're scared. Try not to give in to it. I... So what, what am I supposed to do? Faith is firing shots at my son, and I'm supposed to be analytical? That's, that's exactly what I'm telling you. Just think about it. Faith values her own life above anybody else's. Her only chance of staying alive is to keep those children alive. So it was a trick? She was just doing it to torture Sonny, just to, to make things worse? I... Okay, fine, fine. Michael's alive, then. He's... he's fine. Carly, I didn't realize you were in Louisiana. Jason told me to come. Don't ask me to leave, because... I was going to say not a moment too soon. Sonny's upstairs. He's staring at nothing. He smashed a window. He deliberately cut his hand, and now he's completely unresponsive. Which room? Um, third door on the left, no. upstairs. Just... Based on what I just witnessed, I think Sonny belongs in a psych ward. Unfortunately, Faith, if she makes contact, she's gonna want to speak to him. Is there a chance in hell that Sonny will be rational enough to negotiate? Buildings recently had the utilities turned on. Start knocking on doors. Faith rented this place, she probably rented it back up, and we need to find it. Yes, ma'am. Hey, if you go anywhere, I want to go with you, okay? I'm not, I'm not going back out. Okay, I just gotta wait till Faith gets desperate enough to make contact. Jason, <sighs> can you at least... Please, please try and get some rest. I just, you know, I just keep thinking about... No, 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 don't, don't do that. Michael is gonna be okay, you're gonna find him. Assistant William Peavy is about to move. He's waiting for a ride out of town. And I have the address. Hey, you got an address on face assistant. All right, let's go. Okay. I'm coming. No, you guys, can you can you just stay here and just distract Reese, do whatever you have to do? Yeah. Don't even think about it! Where are my children? How would I know? Next one's gonna be in your gut. Now you can beg for the ambulance while we slowly watch you bleed to death. Or you tell me where my children are. I see you've located Ms. Roscoe's accomplice. What if Reese walked in on Sonny and Jason putting a gun to some guy's head and she arrested them both? I think we really would have heard something by now, Carly. Not necessarily. Well, you know more about this than me, but I can tell you one thing. Jason is not going to let anything or anyone stop him from finding your kids. You better be careful. You're starting to sound a lot like me. I like to say something over and over again to convince myself that it's true. By the way, Jason hates that. Drives him crazy. He likes fact over wishful thinking. Maybe that's what I'm doing. Maybe. Maybe I'm trying to convince myself that my kids are okay, and... Maybe I'm wrong, maybe. Maybe I'm living in denial. I know from denial. Carly, when I woke up in that hospital and Jason told me my daughter had died, I refused to believe him. Even though deep down I knew it was true because I could feel her loss. You know, I could, I could feel the lack of her in this world. Do you feel the same way about Michael and Morgan? No. Good. Good. Then you're on the right track. You're staying positive. You're sending love to your kids. That's what a mother is supposed to do. And don't forget, Faith needs your kids as bargaining chips. I know, I know it sounds terrible, but it's true. She's not going to hurt them. 
Martin and Sonny and Jason, they are going to find this assistant of Faith's and make him give up her location. I'm sure of it. How did Jason find this guy anyway? Lorenzo Alcazar called and told him where to look. No reason to call undue attention. You're alone, you call for backup. I decided that other law enforcement personnel would only impede the interrogation process. Oh, wait a second. You're that fed, aren't you? Take me into protective custody. Oh, sorry, I'm not here in my official capacity. In fact, if anyone should ask, I'll deny being here at all. Oh, maybe you don't understand. Maybe you don't understand what's happening here. This isn't some friendly Q&A. These guys are gonna kill me. You're probably right. Unless you tell them where Faith Roscoe is keeping Mr. Corinthos's children. Oh. Bam! <laughs> now I'm not gonna ask you again. Where are my children? St. Bartholomew's. It's an old abandoned church at the end of Planting Field Road. What, Faith? Two men are inside. No sign of kids. PV said there's an annex at the back. All right, you stay here. Make sure no one gets somebody tries one. We'll go through. Okay. for my children. Don't kill her, the children aren't here. 